Good afternoon, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. We are at beautiful uh, Glen Cove Marina down here at Lake of the Ozarks on a sunny spring day. And today we're going to show you this beautiful Chris Craft 34 Catalina. Robert Seifer is on board and he's going to do a walkthrough with you. Enjoy. Yes, as introduced, this is Robert Seifer with Chris Craft Boats and Big Thunder Marine. First of all, I'd like to point out the styling, the design, and the painted hull of this beautiful Chris Craft. This is something that no other boat provides. When you walk, go into any yacht club from New York, south of France, to Newport Beach, they'll always know you're in a Chris Craft. Coming about the hull of the boat, comes right here nice fiberglass table finished real nice and that's uniquely put underneath this nice lounger this lounger rolls up and very simple the table and the extended lounge pops out you don't have to mess with putting on different uh, pads and whatnot it just flips on over then big heavy duty table is sitting right under there as well so when you get back to it all you need to do is flip it right back in and goes away real simple and you're back to lounging so that's a real nice design there I don't want to sound redundant through the whole thing but the one thing that everybody says when you're selling a Chris Craft it's the fit the finish and the build of this boat it's the finest around it makes it very easy to sell a boat when you know you're the best so I could say that through this whole boat from everything, from the helm design, from the interior, from the carpet, uh, the seagrass carpeting, it just goes to show that the boat was done right. Here in this pilot house, we got a real nice, extremely large, well-covered hard top. On that hard top, it's been painted underneath. It has spreader lights. And as we get to the helm, you'll note that the speakers are even painted the same color. Some boats you go to and you got white speakers, black top, everything has been painted and all go, it forms together. So you got your laser cut, teak inlaid Chris Craft design here. Beautiful. No other company does it this way. Going to one of the most important parts and expensive parts of the boat is this dive door boarding boarding door once you have one of these you'll never go with anything else this makes it extremely simple for the people to get in elderly or ladies they put on a nice sundress or a pair of white pants the last thing they want to do is jump in and out of the boat over the furniture once you have this design you'll never want to go back now conveniently and makes it the best for everybody in the family is this ladder system this gets thrown right over the dive door, makes it extremely simple to get up on the boat instead of hauling your butt over the back. So that's, that's giant here on the lake because we do a lot of coving out, a lot of swimming around the boat. Real nice now is we've got a really large seven capacity uh, bow uh, seating back here that folds up extremely easy if you want more room on the boat. It just right into the gunnels, very simple, very easy, gets folded away. Another dive door, another boarding ladder. This is a walkthrough transom. With the walkthrough transom here, swimming on the boat makes it easy. We've got a fresh water shower on the rear. Right there. Couple of rod holders. 
Got to have those here at the lake. Not everybody fishes, but it's nice to have it. This boat here is 34 foot. It's got a 10-10 beam and we're powered with triple 400s. Yep, that's what I said, triple 400s. I think we could be the only boat, Chris Craft 34 Catalina, that has the triple 400s. So we at Big Thunder like to go a little big on our power there. So entertainment uh, settee here, council. You got a nice cooktop, fresh water sink, live well if needed. It's insulated, it's got a drain. We use it as a cooler. You also have the uh, refrigerator system here, keeping some more drinks and maybe some uh, fresh sandwiches cold. Drawers for utensils, bottle openers, and whatnot. Everything has a place. Everything, there's a reason why they did it this way, designed it that way. Stainless steel um, hinges here. So not just one, not just gonna fall apart. Real nice, you got a padded seagrass. Going up to the helm. If we can get this, Jeremy, these are spreader lights. And if you've seen, they're all contoured, cut in. These are the speakers I was talking about. Custom painted to match the top. Sure shade. Every person will appreciate this after the third or fourth day in the hot sun on the boat. This sure shade is gonna extend itself out all the way to the aft of the boat here. Keeping everybody here out of the sun. Getting to the helm here. Now this is the spot where that fit, that finish, that quality of the build really comes in. You can see you got two big Garmin screens here. Minimal buttons because everything is integrated into that Gar those Garmin screens. We've got a few essentials out here. You've got joystick trim tabs real important let's have a couple cup holders up here for the captain three seats jeremy note the uh the nice vinyl on this all monogrammed this is all done right at the Chris craft plant right there they make the seat they do the vinyl they do the stitching they do the monogram everything right there and look at the hewning on this uh on the aluminum here on these seats really high quality, extremely tight. So after four, five, 10 years of use, it's not gonna be sloppy. So real nice on that. Another thing you wanna note throughout the boat is little accents of all the teak, making it that classic design, making it that, that Chris Craft brand. So we're gonna go on to the, uh, into the little cabin here. It's got a nice center council cabin. Nice twin bed. If you have to crash overnight, if you want to, you know, just make a romantic weekend and throw the air conditioner on. It does have AC. It runs off of a battery pack that will run you four to six hours of AC throughout the, the evening or the day. Kids can go down there and play games. Kids can go down there and get out of your hair for a while. It also has a real nice full head there. Note that the design on this door, it's not just a couple of uh, hinges and flip flap. It's a very nice secure door, fits solid. So that's about my whole walkthrough on the boat here. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. It's Robert Cypher at Big Thunder Marine. And remember one thing, when you're out purchasing a boat, dealership and service matters. We have the dealership and we have the best service team in the industry. Thanks a lot. I appreciate all your time, folks.